problems at the start for the four were we Vicky and she made an uncharacteristic skip here they come often trotting in this casual breeze stakes division quick beginning in the center for modern mass outside of her wine rack Hanover then it's back inside to Susie's Lady, almost off stride there when Intense Justice as Chris Christopher had to steady her for a couple of steps. Outside fifth goes McKee's Angel, and despite her early problems, Orwee Vicky has caught the pack but races back in sixth. To the quarter they go. May out to the front with Modern Mass, dropped to the pocket spot when Wine Rack Hanover quartered 27 and 3. Third inside to Susie's Lady, trotting along fourth, Intense Justice. Getting underway fifth outside, trots up McKee's Angel. We had a pocket pop as Wine Rack Hanover could have had a two-hole trip. Jengra opted to send her to the front, and it's Wine Rack Hanover trying to get by. Modern Mass gives way. Now third outside comes McKee's Angel with a backstretch rush. Overland from in fourth is Warwe Vicky. Back inside fifth, Susie's Lady. Trailing sixth, Intense Justice. 56 and four the half. Another lead change. McKee's Angel and Filion brushing to the front now. Back into second goes Wine Rack Hanover. Third outside trots Warwe Vicky. The rail from in fourth belongs to Modern Mass. Advancing on cover, Intense Justice. Fifth now head to helmet. And Susie's Lady back in sixth. They bunch up going to three quarters. Filion swings away on McKee's Angel. Second at the rail is Wine Rack Hanover. Third outside, where are we, Vicky? The rail fourth, Modern Mass. Intense Justice fires off cover with a backfield rally. Three quarters in 125 and 2. And it's McKee's Angel coming into the stretch. Under attack by Wine Rack Hanover. Modern Mass angling out third. Intense Justice far outside fourth. McKee's Angel still there, holding on at the inside, drawing clearly. Wine Rack Hanover, Modern Mass, and here's a flying Susie's Lady on the grandstand side. McKee's Angel holding on. Susie's Lady ran out of racetrack, 154 and 2 the win time. Casual Breeze, second division in the books. McKee's Angel, now a Grand Circuit winner. Uh, ben Bergeon, winning conditioner, just recently took over the training on this Philly. Uh, work in progress. What have you had to do with her to keep her flat? Well, the first time we raced her, she she made a misstep, uh, bad step coming down the lane, but I think she was going to win the goal. Uh, we made a few adjustments in the shoeing in front, and... Uh, we requalifier and uh, Sylvain said good. Yeah, we were good. So now we're okay. I mean, it looked like he had to be a little careful with her in the back stretches. You know, races yeah. like this, though, will that just help her get her confidence back? Well, I think trotting wise, uh, we're okay. She was a little aggressive tonight in the first turn. So that's why Sylvain up to, to go uh, try to go for the lead on the backside. Yeah. I'd like to her to be a little more hmm, softy, maybe. Yeah. But we'll work on it. Next gold's not until the end of September, but she is eligible to the Simcoe. That's coming up uh, two weeks from tonight. Is okay. that the game plan for her? Oh, yeah, for sure. I don't know. I, she's eligible to the Simcoe? Yep. Yeah, she'll be there. All right, yeah, I, you're yeah. not scared of a little stakes race. You've got a couple that are going to be in the Good Times final. Yeah. Uh, one was a winner earlier tonight. Stravinsky got in as well. Yeah. Maybe uh, what were your thoughts on I their have, performances? I have three in, and uh, they all race pretty good. I was happy. I was pleased with all of them. Even Stravinsky was fit, but I thought he raced real well. Uh, he was strong at the wire. He had to maneuver around a little bit, around some horse, dead horse. Uh, not dead horse, no, but a uh, horse that had enough, no. And uh, Yannick said he was strong at the end. And uh, Theo, uh, well, I'm okay with him. And uh, Hayek, I was happy. He, he tried against two hours. I think he tried his own mile, 52 and four, 27 and four last quarter. I was very pleased that he raced in the hole. And uh, eventually he will have to race in the hole. You know, if they race in front all the time, that's no good. They, yeah. You don't make good hours like that. They need to race in the hole. Yeah. Well, you know, you keep winning all these races. You're going to be talking to me lots more. 
I don't care. That's all right, good. there you go. You'll take it. All right. Okay. Nice job, buddy. Okay, thank all you. All right. <laughs> ben Bearjean wins the casual breeze here with McKee's Angel at 154 and 2.